<laughs> and now, to the millions and millions of listeners and viewers all across the world, it's the That's Not Christian Podcast. Hey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's what up? Go. It's your boy Switch. I'm here with your man Jimmy. I'm here with your man Jay. And I'm here hey. with your man Ant and our very, very special guests, Kasiri and Bree K. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, go. we cherry because my man finally got it right after 10 I days. finally got it right. I was jacking up these girls' names, hard body, and I sincerely apologize. <laughs> take, take, switch. You should, please you should take, feel bad. You should please accept bad. my apology. No, don't accept nothing. <laughs> Dang. What's going on, y'all? How every, how's everybody doing? Everybody's Amazing. ready for the festivities this week. Yes. Beautiful. Oh, everything yes, is lovely. Right. Everything is beautiful. For some man. coquitos. That's not Christian. No, it's not. <laughs> but, but you should uh-huh. definitely get a, a mug from that shop that that's not Christian.com. For your coquito? Get a mug sure. and also get new merch that's dropping. Ooh. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah. You got like what? We got what? We got what? Three, three new designs. Is that right? This sounds not, right. Am I, am I not counting properly? That's three, right? It, two, two, three logos, and yeah, three. We we'll get everything that's on there. <laughs> get everything. Use, get everything. use promo. Yeah. Use promo code thankful T H N K F L for thirty percent off. And if wow. you're listening to this. On Monday, you can use Cybermon, C Y B E R M O N. Is that like Jamaican? Monday. Cybermon. I was about to cyber yes. Cybermon. Cybermon. It's because you know I went to Cybermon. I went to Jamaica. Sim Sima. Yeah, I went to Jamaica, and then we had the first year anniversary uh, pod, and then the girls were there, you know, all of that stuff. So we was like, all right, we'll do Cybermon. Ah, uh, makes sense. Nice. Makes sense. Yeah. That was a lie, but anyway, gotta forgive. Me. <laughs> gotta <not> forgive me. <laughs> That's not Christian. <laughs> oh man! So where you where you go? What are you guys doing this week? Y'all going to be with y'all families? Y'all on lockdown? What are y'all doing? Oh, no more damn, than ten. Boy. Well, if Both New York governor lockdown, we're I guess uh as of when was it Saturday? I think Saturday after 10 p.m. or something, we weren't supposed to be outside. And then on Thanksgiving, you're supposed to like not have more than 10 people at a gathering and like less than three households be outside. Use plastic. Y'all are Spanish. Cleaner. That's not possible. We're all Wait, Spanish in California. So what, what state are you late? You got California? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. In New York, there. Well, we don't. Do we have a curfew? Yeah. Well, the bars and the, and the and everything's closed after 10 p.m. But yeah, we have the ten. That's when COVID hits the hardest. After the ten months. people yeah. limit in a red, is <laughs> yours? A, is you guys a residency as well? Like ten people in your own household? Uh, household? Maybe I don't know. We're yeah, not really cause... listening because <laughs> I try well, to tell him. Who listens. Well, Gavin Newsom's not even listening to himself. Right. Right. So Ooh, I'm just well, following his lead. Right. You know? Exactly. Oh. His example. Exactly. Right. The example wow. of our leaders. Shots fire. Exactly. We need to get our sound. Who's that? That's your that's your mayor or our governor? Governor. Yeah, governor. California's governor. Governor Newsom. Democrat. Yeah. Democrat city, right? State. Yeah. Democrat state. State. We have yeah. our state. Yeah. We got Cuomo. He's saying the same type of stuff. But yeah, they call it they call each other every night. <laughs> after, after 10 p.m., they call each other. Hey, so how are you going to screw us? How are you going to screw your city over today? <laughs> wow, shots fired. That's Cuomo, right, shots fired. Cuomo lying. He Italian. You know they're gonna have mad people at his house. Mad people, right? And pasta, mad pasta, too. mad pasta and vino. So I know he lying. Yo, so I, my 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 Thanksgiving is probably up in the air because my yeah. wife, her coworker. Um, oh, is exposed has uh is is got tested positive for COVID. So she got to okay. take a spot. So now she got to take a she got to take a test and see if she's positive for COVID. But she doesn't have Uh-oh. any symptoms or anything like that. Uh-oh. So depending on the results, we not we might not be uh, joining anybody. Yes. Monday, Switch's wife test positive. 
<laughs> that's that's that's, that's, that's gonna be that's gonna be the title Headlines, of this video, man. Look at that. <laughs> now, Switch was over here complaining that he feels tired and all that. I all right, like, he oh, that's, that's, true. True. that's true. I do. That's the people's names up. It, it makes sense. Right, <laughs> right. right. That, that, yeah, that exactly. part, man's confused and everything. That's true. Oh, Delirious. Right. Maybe. <laughs> Switch. Have I you, heard have you bad money. I heard bad money tested positive. Oh, oh, no, you're breaking it. news, important news. <laughs> Only for you. <laughs> Which point? <laughs> what did he test positive for? COVID. Oh, <laughs> dang. Oh. I don't know. That you know, that's funny. My <laughs> wife was like, I'm not surprised. <laughs> wow. Hey, are we still talking COVID? <laughs> yeah, All of the above. All of the above. Oh, man. He probably hanging with Harry Styles. Ooh. Wow! Man. <laughs> this episode is out of my control. <laughs> yo, and why you say that though? <laughs> why you say that? Because Harry Styles, yo, he likes he likes to dress free. Dress free. <laughs> yeah, I guess. What's what up with Harry Styles? Yeah, he man, made, he was on the Vogue cover, right? In a dress. Yeah, first, the, Vogue the cover, first man. solo guy apparently to be on a Vogue cover. A Vogue cover. Wow! For, first solo guy. They never uh, had solo group of guys or something. Oh, that's interesting. I guess they've only had groups of guys and solo women. Who's the one that was that dressed up in like the sheep, the boat sheep dress? <laughs> the, oh, Young Thug. Oh yeah, he was, but he wasn't on Vogue. No, that was his own album. His album, huh? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh wow! Okay. So is first solo around. guy, and it's a dress. It's a guy in a dress. It's a dress, yo. And but this ain't the first time he wore a dress. I saw him in like a like in a Gucci dress or something before. But like he gay though, like right? Red car, huh? He's gay. I think he's bisexual. <clears throat> That's gay. I'm pretty sure he's out about it. Yeah, he's gay. I don't know if That's he's gay. catching or catching. He's gay either way. Right. <laughs> what did you what? just say? <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know if he's pitching or catching. <laughs> he said what he said whether you, he's pitching or catching. He's yeah, gay. You know he's gay. <laughs> no, you know, because oh I, I, I think God. I think I think I'm glad he said that because like there's people who make statements like uh what's his name? Yeah, they catching. No, yeah. No, they pitching, right? So they're not gay. Right, right, right. Wait, like dude. So I'm confused. Who is this dude? Oh, he's Listen, from what direction? direction? Oh, I'm glad you wasn't asking something else. He's from what? <laughs> it's like why he was confused. <laughs> you never heard of the group One Direction? <laughs> oh, One Direction. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so he's what? The lead singer or something? Or just... He was. One of them? He was. He was. One, yeah. Okay. Yeah. They don't exist anymore. So like a boy group. Yo. Yeah, I remember them, but okay. Yeah. So, he's so Candace but, Owens was making comments about him? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. She just said... I mean, she, yeah. Man, right? Men need to be men. Exactly. Right. She tweeted something like, "We need more masculine <laughs> men." She said more yeah. than that, but I know the end of it. Was right. Like, we need more masculine men. I mean, yeah, something like that. Like Mr. Brownie, Brownie. I'm not. I'm not against that. You know what I'm saying? I mean, well, first do, solo man. Guys, what do you guys think about the argument that in other cultures men wear dresses? Or what things cultures? that are kind of similar. what cultures? What cultures yeah, mean more dresses? Eastern, That's like more dress. Eastern cultures, you know, they have different things. They're like it's like a garment that looks like a dress or whatever. Like, what do you? Like, think I would, I would totally wear one of those joints that them dudes from Saudi Arabia wear. Them Which joints look fresh. What? What are you talking about? Like, like the like long like tunics like with, with, like the, oh, with the oh, with the yeah, 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 yeah. That'd yeah, that's mean, cool. I'll yeah, be looking like uh like I'll rock that in Dubai. French Montana. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. At the mm. at the TNC Roadshow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I I'll right. rock one of those. I'm not no. Yeah, I'm not rocking no dress. Well, what, was there a reason why different. he he wore a dress? Was it like for shock value, was so it, we could be talking about it on the podcast. And there, yeah, yeah. Uh, did he drop something? Did he drop an album or a song or anything? <laughs> I don't did think so. Because stop it, Ant. Don't you say whatever you're gonna say. What did he just drop, Ant? Just mute Ant right now. <laughs> yeah. Like this whole segment, just mute him. <laughs> what did he? Yo, did Ant, he what did he drop? <laughs> nah, I just want to know because is w- was there a statement that he was trying um, to make? Like, oh, well, it's probably for the man. magazine cover. No, it right, is. Football. It is for the magazine. No, cover, I mean, bro. like, it's just not that. He, I don't know if he was <laughs> dropping an album or something. I'm just saying, like, 
It's probably just attention no. for the mag and, um, and the... What I'm trying to say was he trying to bring attention to like gender equality oh, kind like of that. thing. Was it like that or oh, probably. You know? well, yeah, yeah, probably. I mean, have you seen the Nas X one too? What? <laughs> oh yeah, Nas X. He dressed up well, he was like Nicki Minaj <laughs> or something for like a Halloween photo shoot thing. Wow. Oh, I didn't little see Nas X, yeah. Yeah. And then another picture just released, like I don't know how last week or something of him kissing himself. Oh, I've seen that. He had, I've like, seen he, that. he had like long hair and stuff. So I'm just like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, mean, yeah, I think I Candace said moment. something about that too. Who? Anyway, Candace? Probably. Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I know Angela Stan. You, you saw one, what? I saw one. He, he, he was wearing makeup like, with that other makeup dude. Um, oh, from YouTube? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, Jeffrey? Yeah, that or, or was it James? I don't remember. But anyway, yeah. Uh, yeah, but I mean, if you look at the pictures, the dress is to me a feminine dress. It is. It's not like it's not like, you know, it's not like a kill. Yeah, no. Yeah, kill or or you Ooh, know, Harry? What talking about. Can we just Harry? Yeah, Harry. About it? Okay. He he looks a hot mess in these pictures. Can we just be real about that? <laughs> now, yeah, say what you want. He's, no, but, yeah. he's like, yeah, yes, be real. Like, don't That's what you're here for. Be real. Let's do it. <laughs> yeah, he look um funny. Now, when you say how mess, you mean like you dig in the look or no? Yeah. It doesn't. Oh, look okay. Good. How, like how, it does oh, okay. not look good. I I think uh, I think a lot of times like people that are kind of pro that like gender neutral type thing or like pro LGBT and things just aren't honest about the fact that like a lot of these people when they're trying to make a statement. They look a hot mess. Like it doesn't even look good. <laughs> like I that's not fly. Like, up, but like, oh, you mean like fashionably? It doesn't. Yeah, it doesn't it was, fit like the well. dress. It wouldn't probably wouldn't even look good on a girl, first of all. But like the dress didn't look good. It was like old lady didn't even try. Right? Yeah, no, there was no effort into it. <laughs> now what? Now what do you think about for like we've seen this before? Dennis Rodman. Um, mm-hmm. That's a good. Uh, point. Prince, right? Or uh no, yeah, I don't, Prince, Prince, I don't think Prince wore a dress. Nah, Prince just Dennis Rodman wore. Yeah, nah. Yeah. Well, there's, been been other that, celeb- there's been other celebrities that have dressed right. Like when you know, Rodman is one clothing. of them. Right. Yeah. So um like how do you like what you guys think in that aspect? Like with them dressing or whatever. I don't know about like them, but I just think that personally in my own life, if I were to evaluate like all of the really like man's man type men that I know or like manly men, they would never wear a dress like that. Like a woman, like any dress. You mean like that? You <laughs> said so like that. Well, because <laughs> I think they might, I like think they might like, like go to Dubai and wear that. You know, like the robe right. thing or something yeah, like ro- that. Yeah, but as far as like a dress, but that's not a dress, a woman, right? Right. I mean, I, I get what you're saying, but like it kind of I, you know what I mean? It's like it's not pants or it's not right. shorts like it's right. the garment there. Right. Well, I guess but, culturally. Right. That's what that's that's acceptable yeah. over there. Yeah, I mean, that's what it is. There's that scripture in the Torah where it says men shouldn't dress like women. Right. Or is, it, or some, is it something like that? Like mm-hmm. men shouldn't right. be dressing like women. Right. And, so, but, but I think I think that's more I think that's more like of an intent though, like you're trying to deceive right. somebody, you know what I'm saying? Versus like, I don't think it was necessarily talking about uh, the contemporary wardrobe, you know what I'm saying? I think it was more so trying to be deceptive, you know? Oh, okay. Like, right. and even, at least that's the understanding I got. Even like when they bring up, oh well, you know, men wear it in other cultures and or dresses or quilts or whatever. Um, how do they feel about homosexuality, though? Right, right, right. They in those other cultures. No, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's, 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 oh, that's a good right. point. That's a very good yeah. point. Yeah, I, I do well, think though that it's interesting because I was actually trying to think about this when you guys sent this topic. Like, I was trying to think about it, and I'm just like, it's just interesting to me because sometimes it does seem like like the masculine manly men that I know. Like I said, they would never wear a dress, um, nothing like that, but. I do think that it's interesting, though, that, like, there's still, like, feminine women that I know, like, we would wear, like, a guy's mm. shirt or hoodie or, you know, whatever, <laughs> something that was made for a guy. Like, we would wear that. Right. So I just think that it's interesting that there is that difference, I guess, between. It's not the same. So you think you think it's, it's it would be cool for a man to wear a dress? Like, like. 
Well, like you would wear your brother's hoodie, right? Or your cousin's hoodie or whatever. Like, do you think that, I don't know, like your, your male cousin borrow wear. your your cardigan would be okay? I mean, I, I you know, because I'm just basing it off of hoodies and sweaters and stuff like that. Do you think that that would be totally acceptable? No, nah, a cardigan, maybe like I, the off- so. I mean, I just said, sweater. yo, it don't have to be a cardigan. I'm just saying, like a girl's sweater, a blouse. It depends, oh, I guess, yeah. right? Because yeah. I, is I know. Any... I'm... Sorry, sorry, I'm so sorry. No, no, no. Go ahead. Oh, is there okay? Is there any piece of clothing other other than like undergarments that is specifically designated for men that women don't wear? No, but there is one for women, which is kind of interesting. Dress. I just think it's just interesting that that exists that's all mm, that's a good point pnc dress is coming soon <laughs> <laughs> stop that's not christian not right. use, use promo code <laughs> thankful <laughs> but have um, you y'all ever seen a man in a dress like <laughs> they look weird man <laughs> it's, it's not made for them like anatomically, <laughs> structure too yes like, anatomically men are built differently and so it doesn't yeah. look good a lot it just doesn't look good most and of then the same thing goes in my opinion, if a woman wears, you know, a, a, sh- a shirt or a sweater that's from a guy, it just looks different, you know, or baggy, you know, jeans or something like that. Right. You know, I've seen, uh, I've known, um, I know one individual that 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 told me like, yeah, I, I buy women's clothing, I guess, because you know mm-hmm. he's not like tall, but sometimes like he'll get a a shirt or whatever, uh, or like um. Like he said, like a cardigan or like a sweater or something, right? And he'd be like, oh, that's hot. But, you know, at first I was like, yo, that's kind of mad, weird, dude. But then I guess I understood. I was like, well, that's his probably his fashion. And he's not he's not gay at all. Like, he's totally straight. But his whole thing was like he likes he's certain like on the, women like, clothing. Like like Prince, you mean? Like with the ruffly right. stuff? Like Nah, not even. Like, it could just be a sweater. <laughs> but, since, <laughs> but since he can... Well, I don't, fit. You know, I don't know. because he could fit into that size he's just right. like yo i could i can buy you know sometimes i'll see something that's in the female section and i can buy no, it and rock no. it so he wanted that petite yeah <laughs> like wayne right wayne be rocking uh leopard leggings and stuff but now like if he's showing oh, right, like his, right. if he's showing like his elbows i mean i mean not his elbows mm-hmm. his shoulders, shoulders and all that then you know i'm gonna be like yo what's good b that's sus, man. Like, what's good? Like that? <laughs> no, not like that. Like, what's Pause. good? What's up with that, man? <laughs> Wait, so is Lil Wayne gay? What? <laughs> not that we know of. Gay? Lil Wayne? Oh, I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Wow, what did... Good. what? Did, well, yeah, I, I don't... Oh, well, I don't... Little Wayne about wearing, like, the leggings and stuff. But mm-hmm. I, I guess I guess I'm thinking about... Okay, so are we... Or not are we, but, like, do you guys think that straight men who would wear like stuff that's more directed towards female fashion do you think that it looks sus do you think that they possibly maybe are gay but they're not out do you think that they could be fully straight and just no, I, I, I believe I they dudes, could be uh, yeah. i believe they're fully straight like i don't always equate their fashion with homosexuality like y'all said you know what i'm saying some yeah. people do it for shock value other people do it for <clears throat> fashion, and other people do it because they're just they they're live gay, a right? homosexual lifestyle. So yeah. I think those are the three options that you get. Yeah. And you have some straight individuals who are like, "Hey, I like that shirt. Well, I could fit into those. Uh, I don't nah. know sneakers nah. or whatever or that color sneakers, right? Because it's like remember, pink was like a gay thing to wear, right? And then Cam came out with the all pink. It's mauve. It's mauve. Mom, it's mauve. So you know what I mean? Yeah. No one, no one questioned him and his sexuality. You know what I'm saying? But for a long time, it was like pink back in the days. Nah, we right. can't rock no pink. But right. then he came out and just like switched it up in, in a way. But um, you know, so. like now that I'm thinking about it, even the gay guys that I know wouldn't wear a dress. Yeah, that's true. You know, so I don't know if wearing a dress would be attached to somebody's. Sex. But I think the difference is we know Harry Styles styles is. Living okay. that type of lifestyle, right? So, yeah, it just makes it that much like, yo, what are you doing? <laughs> but yeah, a dress, a full length dress. I don't, I don't, I don't see no man looking. 
Yeah, no. Yeah, I don't know if that can pass. Like that to me is like undergarments. That's borderline like a that's like a dude wearing like a, 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 a <laughs> it's not gonna yeah, it's just can't not even, gonna, you can't you know, even talk, can't even your brain does not compute. Yeah, like it's just like nah you what, don't, what about like um women who wear like men's clothes, not necessarily like a man's hoodie or something, but somebody like let's say like um uh Janelle Monet or something like that. You've seen her style and the way she dresses, she wears like tuxedos. But she's feminine like though, like or even I mean, like Billie, Billie Eilish too. Like she wears very, very baggy clothes and stuff. Yeah, yeah, but see, but see, like those are two different. Like see, Janelle Monae and Billie Eilish. Like Billie Eilish will walk off like a dude. Janelle Monae will walk off like a like a female. You know what I'm saying? Like I guess it's the way they carry themselves too. Because uh, uh, Janelle Monae, you she could wear whatever, and she still has that like. I don't know the way she carries herself, the way she'll rock it or whatever. Isn't she right. like um like uh, gender neutral or something like that as well? Janelle Monet. Yeah, oh, I, I think she was with um that girl on Creed. She was? I think she was with her for a little bit. I don't know if she still is, but oh man, everybody's gay. <laughs> oh <my gosh. laughs> so so how does this translate into our community, right? Christian community is this acceptable? Is this? I mean, I, mean, I don't ever see dudes, that you got dudes wearing uh, pink boas and you know painting Art. the nails in CHH. You know? Oh man, you do. I'm gonna stay quiet. And is that is that cool? It's good. Huh? All right. Is, nails don't bother nails me. Cool. But what did you say? Is that cool, Aunt? A pink boa. Yeah, you know, like a little boa, a little fufu, oh, a little feathery oh, 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 joint. Oh. You know. Uh, with pink nails. <laughs> Wait, who did that? <laughs> for, the, for the fact that I, I am nearing an interview with this particular, <laughs> I'm gonna stay quiet. Wait, who's going? <laughs> Wait, who, who is it? Who did that? I don't know. <laughs> don't worry about it. What? what? Drop. Because I, I don't know. I think personally, I don't really have a problem with it. With nail nails. Uh, yeah, with, with the nails. Nails. Stuff like that. No, I know. Yo, you got. Guys, do you put clear polish on your on your nails whenever you get a manicure? Mm-mm. Oh, who are you talking no. to? Oh, I said guys. No. Oh, I just I, I thought it was a broad. No. No, no, no. no. You don't. Yeah, okay. I mean I, I used to. I mean I've done it a few times. I don't get my nails done anymore. So. But I mean I've never done a color, just the clear coat. That's I don't it. even do the clear. Let them just, you know, whatever they do. <laughs> just leave it, it like out. that. Natural. <laughs> Uh, okay. All right. Just let them do whatever they do, huh? Just soak it, buff it out, whatever it is that they Yo, do. That and don't want nobody questioning him about nothing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> want, There's no questions over here, son. Yo, and, as default is pause, right? It's pause. <laughs> Everything Just in pause. case. Pause. Don't pull none of them little brushes out. Just do what you do. Right. You know, All right. I'm, well. I guess. I guess that's kind of up in the air, right? We don't really have. Uh, I guess we got to just be careful what we dress and what we, you know, shun the appearance of evil. I guess, right? Like, yeah, I saw one of the comments that Candace was like, uh, "What they said? Well, clothes um, don't have a gender." So like, what? Okay. Candace, no, somebody. Oh, somebody commented on Candace and said, "Yeah, they replied to her. Yeah, 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 they replied to her because they were calling yeah. her all kind of names." Well, that that's kind of like what Brie King Kasari was talking about. How like for men, there really isn't anything that's yeah. specific, right? Except for like our draws. Yeah, well, I mean, there's women that are wear that. <laughs> True, they wear briefs and boxers too. You yeah, know? so we don't have anything. But it goes back to your point, Jimmy. Like, <laughs> I guess the heart behind it and the intent behind it, right? Right. So, I see, but then to some people, some people, let's say you want to wear something in particular, and their intention is, oh, because it feels comfortable or they look nice, like the your the person you were talking about that goes and buys uh, women's clothing. Um, their intent is because they like it or whatever. But then other people will look at that and be like, that's kind of sus. Yeah, yeah, like I'm not getting drunk with that dude. Right. I mean, you shouldn't be so getting awesome. drunk anyway, but you gotta watch right. that. Dude. What? Right. No right. coquitos. With yo, that dude. Just admitted, yo, I'm not getting drunk with that right. dude. Not with it. So, that dude around, you can't, you know, 
You can't try some, right? You do might get too comfortable. Hey. (laughs) So, so all of this. So, is it more like uh, cultural, or or is there like a specific? uh, I think there's a lot of like artsy guys who just are full on straight, but they like to paint their nails or you know whatever. I think that you see it a lot in like rock. Um, for example, where they wear makeup or they have long hair or, you know, like stuff like that. They wear tight pants, stuff like that. Um, and they're totally straight. They're not gay. Mm-hmm. So it could yeah. be, you know, I don't know, just minor cultural differences or whatever. <clears throat> yeah. So you think it's a cultural difference with Harry Styles? Well, no, he's really good. <laughs> no, that dude's really, yeah. Yeah. yeah, he's really good. He's really about that he, life. I think that's more of a statement. Yeah, right. I don't make. yeah, yeah. yeah. He got gay songs? Nah, I don't know. Gay what does songs. that mean? What does that even mean? Like, is he singing to dudes? Like, he got <laughs> first verse. No, I don't think he's uh, like. Like, he got first, like, and he's going on the viral, downward spiral in this conversation. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, like, <laughs> what's that dude? He's thinking, like, what's the, uh, that dude from, uh, he's in, uh, Sam, Sam, what the heck is his name? Sam something. Sam Smith. Sam Smith? Sam Smith, yeah, yeah. What, you he's know, he got dude? songs. Yeah, he's he's gay. He's openly gay. What? One of his My, one of his songs was dedicated to that dude, dude. that broke up with him or whatever. So he like wow. Oh, one I his didn't... whole album, one of his whole albums mm-hmm. was like the, the, he, yeah, he yeah, writes for a lot of people too, right? The, uh, I don't does know. he? Am I bugging? Sam Smith does he write for other people? Oh, I don't probably know. does. I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. Um, so, yeah it's on some Frank Ocean type stuff. Right. Yeah, man. But then you got so. you got other cultures like you guys were saying that like uh I think it's in Burma, they wear like skirts and some Polynesians. Right. I was they, oh yeah, they do. They wear like they wear wraps, sarongs, I don't know what they're called. Yeah. And they're like manly guys. Yeah, they're like walking around with machetes and, right. and chancletas like in the yeah. AK-47. Yeah. Yeah. Right. And you got the that's, typical Hawaiian uh, male who wears, you know, those the grass skirts or whatever. But but that's accepted culture. They don't walk around like every that. day like that. If they're into like the dance, then yeah, yeah right. I'm but, saying, but they're not like going no, to Walmart like, with a grass skirt on. Yeah, no, they're they were with the with the with the with the other skirt though. I forgot what it's called. But it's like yeah. it's like a it's like a bed sheet that they wrap around their waist or whatever, you know. Yeah. So I guess yes. I guess clothing doesn't have any gender. <laughs> no. It just really depends on the culture and the intent at right. the end of the day. Right. Yeah. TNC two tops coming soon. <laughs> For men? For men. Yeah. But yo, yo, <laughs> fellas, okay. what y'all fellas out there, man. I catch y'all in a dress. Y'all getting roasted. You hear me? Y'all remember y'all uh, remember the uh y'all remember the uh, uh <laughs> the the episode? Y'all remember the Boondocks episode where Riley oh, was wearing a two <laughs> top of the skirt? <laughs> nah, I've never oh, seen that. Was it, was it Thuggalicious? <laughs> yeah, I heard. I don't Yo, watch that. That's they not said Christian, that episode. That's not Christian. Not I don't Christian. watch that. I only watch, <laughs> veggie, I only watch veggie Tales. <laughs> wow. Even them. Anyway, that's a different topic. Even them what? Don't worry. Don't stop watching it. That's all I'm saying. L- Larry, <laughs> Larry Boy never wore a dress, bro. <laughs> Larry Boy. <laughs> Don't you dare talk about Larry Boy or Junior Asparagus in your life, B. All right. Well, I'll send you guys some <laughs> links <Asparagus>. later. <laughs> <laughs> um, Somebody went this uh, uh, summer vacation Bible school. 